everyone, and welcome back to Mew Lives, the Kitten Rescue Cafe. And we still don't have kittens at the cafe, but we'll get to that eventually. For now, Amelia Sky Baker has finally been promoted to a brand new job as a mixologist. <gasps> Amelia, look at how cute those are! I have never made these before. This is so ridiculously exciting. Look at those little cream puffs. Oh my gosh, they are precious. Amelia, good job. And they're excellent quality. Yes! Okay, that's really exciting. Let's go ahead and I wonder if I can like have her put those in her inventory. Oh, and she even got points for making a group meal just then. Make Franks. We're not going to make Franks and beans, you absolute goose. She can sell it to the local bakery for 28 samoles and some fame. How much did it cost us to make those? Let me double check. It was only $2 to make those cream tarts. Oh my gosh. Yes, sell it to the local bakery. Are you kidding? That's going to be literally your job. Oh my gosh. This is actually how she can make more money. <gasps> okay, guys. Well, hello and welcome back. So yes, last time I explained at length what this place is, the Rosewater Cafe. It serves mostly really delicious drinks that just make you feel the soul of sweetness and the, the most innocent of the romantic feelings you possibly could feel. Very popular, especially among the celebrities who are also attracted here by the owner, Poppy Sweets, based off of Poppy from Animal Crossing. I did a special episode uh, creating her and her cat, which is kind of like a cat squirrel, meant to be the squirrel version of her from Animal Crossing. But this is just a really popular place. Poppy has a great reputation, and she also is friends with Nail, Nell Nut Tree, who is an amazing sim created by my wonderful Wendell patrons, who has befriended Amelia over the past few days and is uh, actually helping her get this new job as a mixologist. So I'm really excited to be here. We're going to try to get her mixology skill leveled up before too much longer. But I talked last time how our biggest goal is going going to be saving up as many of these aspiration points as possible so that we can get the professional slacker so that we instead of actually having to physically go to work all the time since we have to keep her in the culinary career to unlock some of the rewards that we need for sky we can keep her at home have her work at her own cafe which would be amazing or have her come to places like this where she can spend her days let's do this again let's bake some more pastries this time let's try fruit tarts oh this is so exciting where she can spend her days working in active careers that we make ourselves using a combination of that slacker aspiration and having like a uh, co-workers who are in a club that she can join here and having a special lot she can go to. I'm probably gonna do that with like almost all of my Sims moving forward in the future. <gasps> and look at these cute little fruit cakes. Oh my gosh, these fruit tarts are adorable too. And it's gonna work out better than I thought because normally Amelia makes $35 an hour uh, going to work. But if we can make more than that by coming here, what, I can't sell it to a bakery so soon again. I guess you have to like wait a little while, huh? Okay, well, I'm gonna put it in her inventory. Bah. Maybe I could set up, if I, like, push come to shove, can I sell it? Fooey. Push come to shove, maybe I could just break out, like, her, her sale table and be like, yo-ho, yeah, we're selling stuff for this place. And we could just say that's, like, the income that she gets from working here. All right, well, that's not going to work as easy as I thought. I'll have to check what the cooldown is on how often you can do this. Uh, but let's try to spend the time that we have before her actual, like, work begins by leveling up her mixology skill and seeing if we can get ourselves into the Rosewater Cafe club. She's already going to work for them. Let's come up here, make drink, practice making drinks. Let's have her practice making drinks. Can she do that? No? Okay, let's have her try again. Can she make drink? And we'll send her up and try making a fizzy fruity drink. Can I kick that sim off? Ugh, okay. We're gonna have to like kick the sim off. Let's go upstairs of the bar. There we go. Okay, quickly, quickly. Practice making drinks. Go, 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 go. Oh, Poppy herself is coming up here. <gasps> Let's see if we can get in good with the boss. Maybe introduce ourselves. Attempt an introduction. 
maybe that'll pull her away so that we can spend some time tending the bar. All right, a little over the top, but friendly, maybe. Poppy's like, I'm kind of working here. Watch this. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. She's, she's showing off her skills. All of that is just sugar, sweets, and spices, by the way. Completely non-alcoholics. Uh, and she's got a juice on the rocks. Let's go ahead and try it out. Maybe we can have, like, the specialty. Oh, Poppy! <laughs> oh, that's terrible! Poppy, you're breaking everything! I can't believe it. This little girl, by the way, is a fan. I don't think she's a fan of us. I think she's a fan of Poppy. But she's really sweet. Maybe she is our fan. Let's just do a friendly introduction. Just in case. And then we'll go ahead. Maybe ask about school. Like, hey, are you a member of the Llama Scouts? There we go. And then, let's see. Can I, can I please practice making drinks now? Get off the bar, Poppy. Here, what if I tell her to tend the bar? I think that'll normally, like, kick the sim who's on it off. Ah, this is not going to work. All right, let's try another attempt introduction. All right, practice making drinks. Quick, quick, quick. Yay! She actually greeted us that time. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, exclaim adoration. Ask to take a picture. Ask about interest. Maybe we can talk about that. We want to make silly faces in the mirror. Uh, we don't need a pet food bowl here, sweetie. She wants to buy a squeaky toy. Ah! Poppy is not amused! Not amused! Uh, maybe we can exclaim adoration? Man, her being a rising star makes it a little hard to approach when we don't have any fame. Maybe if we could earn more fame through, like, selling our stuff to a bakery, that would help. Uh, can we ask for your autograph? Maybe so you'll stop making drinks? <gasps> That's so cute! She made a fizzy drink! We might be able- oh, are we gonna get an autograph? Yay! Poppy, thank you! Oh, I'm so excited! This feels like getting an autograph from my little favorite Animal Crossing character. One of my many favorite Animal Crossing characters. They're all my favorites. <laughs> Yay! Alright! And now we're super happy. Maybe the boss is gonna like us after all. Uh, look! We have her autograph! Oh, we could sell it to a collector, but I don't want to. Can we appraise it? How much is it gonna be if we appraise it? All right, please let me tend the bar. Let me practice making drinks, boss. I can do this. All right. It's been appraised for $20. All right, well, now at least we can show our stuff. Boom, there we go. And we can start gaining a little bit more skill by practicing drinks before it is time for work. Nice. And we've got her autograph, though. That is totally going up on my wall. Hello, Erica. She is a fan, too. There's so many celebrities here. Everybody is just following Poppy around. It's adorable. Hi, who are you? Anya, she is a fan as well. Which... I, that's really cute, though. It's like Poppy kind of, like, showed us how she wants us to make the foods and then has left us to our own devices. But I really hope we can get promoted soon. We do have work in two hours. That may make things kind of interesting. And after that, we're just going to try... Uh, to basically focus on one thing at a time. I've constantly over the last month really struggled with Amelia because I buy it off so much more than I can chew because I want my sims to do all of the things. And I have now finally accepted that what Amelia will be doing is one bite at a time. Oh, her work starts in an hour. The Humor and Hijinks Festival is in town. That would be fun to maybe go to uh, to like do some recording, especially if we could dress up Clover in a cute outfit in the future. But again... Biting off more than I can chew. We'll think about being famous celebrity cats in the future. For now, let's just try to make some good drinks. We're so close to leveling up. Maybe I can, like... Do you have to go to work? In, like, 20 minutes? She's a little uncomfortable from a disappointing drink. Uh, oh, and now Lily wants to go to the Humor and Hijinks Festival. She does kind of seem like an up-and-comer. She's been seen around a lot of celebrities. Maybe maybe we've been blowing her off too, too much, and she just wants to be, like, a good friend. I'll have to think about that. Oh, and now we're happy from a celebrity autograph? We can't decide? We're feeling happy because we're cheerful? Okay, almost done. 
Yes, all right, we reached Mixology at level three. We learned the Ridgeport recipe, and now we are gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna start work. So, all right, I'm, I'm going to have her go ahead and work uh, <clears throat> here, and we'll see how she does on her very first day. <gasps> oh my gosh! We're actually getting this horrible chance card on her very first day at work. Cash shortage. It's finally the end of Amelia's shift, but she can't go home yet. The cash register is short. Amelia Skye knows it wasn't her doing and has to decide to either report her coworker or keep quiet about it. <gasps> report one of the Rosewater workers? They're a really close-knit tight team. But if we keep quiet about it, then it's probably gonna be docked out of our pay. Oh my gosh, I feel like Amelia would just feel absolutely terrible and conflicted. I don't want to lose the job, uh, but the cash is short. But if we don't, I mean, I don't think that she could report somebody. Uh, not on her first day, not considering we've made such a huge deal about where she's working. So I think she's going to keep quiet and just assume that there's, you know, there was, it was an honest mistake. I'm sure it just had something to do with like rose water ways that she just doesn't understand yet. Please don't fire me. Amelia should have spoken up. When the boss finds out about the money missing from the register, he makes the staff pay it back to them from their tips. Aw, oh, man. All right. So that wasn't as bad as I thought it could be, but I think it, it could have it been better. It could have definitely been better. Also, Clover, <laughs> Clover and Tian are sound asleep in the rain. That is so sad. Oh, my gosh. Can I, like, get them a little... I mean, they have a bed they could go in. Oh, all right. That's it. Can I make a small little hut, even, that they could go inside? Because this is technically our home lot. How much would it cost? Nope, we can't do it yet, guys. Insignificant funds. Insignificant, insufficient funds. <laughs> all right, don't worry. They're just on an adventure. We'll get them back home soon. And she's home! And look at her! She is enjoying the rain and she has just passed her very first day working at the Rosewater Cafe. And it's actually going to be her first day for a long time. She doesn't go back to work for four more days. Four more beautiful, blissful days that we might finally get something done with this freaking cat cafe. We can start cleaning it. We can start spending the extra money sprucing up all of the different spots. She can spend some time finally writing to her grandmother because it has been so long we can use the extra money let's make more cookies and take them over oh my gosh to zach to thank him oh my goodness he does tend to work at nights so let's come inside gosh there's just so much to clean <laughs> But we did not get promoted. However, even with that chance card, we still had a great day and we were told we did a great job. So hopefully over time, we will be able to like integrate ourselves more with the other members of the Rosewater Cafe career, like her co-workers basically. And uh, we'll be able to impress Poppy enough that we can move up the ranks a little bit. Also, where did those cookies go? Oh man. Apparently these you can't sell. Can you only maybe sell like one per day? Who knows? I'm gonna have to look up how you can sell things for fame because that was really cool. Uh, speaking of fame, we can actually upload some of these pictures to Simstagram that you take for fame. So that would be kind of cool. Uh, also, we're going to work on getting her aspiration points as high as possible because that's what we're really after right now. We have three beautiful, blissful days to really try to get her aspiration points up to 4,000. That's going to be so much fun. Amelia, this is going to be great. Oh my gosh. Let's start by cleaning up your house a little bit though and like filling up the, the cat food bowls, making sure they're doing good. All right. And then she also wants to prepare franks and beans for some unbeknownst reason. She wants to have a mud fight, but we don't have anybody here to have a mud fight with. That's just really cute. She wants to take a vacation day from her career. <laughs> Well, lucky for her, tomorrow is actually going to be, or I should say in the morning, is going to be a very special day because it's our castle tour day. I almost forgot about it because Amelia's life is just so freaking busy all the time. But, you know, while she was scrolling down Simstagram, uh, on Sunday, she did roll randomly to increase her pipe organ skill, or at least dabble in it for her event of the week. 
<laughs> so we are going to actually send her to a castle tour. She is going to wear a special costume for that, and she's going to go and appreciate a fancy castle that has a pipe organ in the morning. Uh, we'll even take the little, let's take the cat cam and let's take Clover. If we can get the, if we can actually get his cone off, I think we'll go ahead and take Clover and maybe give him some sort of little outfit to fit in with the castle. Cause I, I think that Amelia kind of misses Clover a little bit. And apparently she's just craving Franks and beans for dinner. I am not gonna question it. There you go. Uh, knock yourself out, my dear. And she wants to, oh, she wants to play an instrument. She's just really getting into all sorts of things. All right, what are you two doing? You can come inside, guys. Do you guys want to come in? They're just, okay. They're just having fun out in the rain. <gasps> we know the recipe for strawberry cake now. <gasps> Maybe we should take some things to Castle Day and we could sell some of our food at, the, at Castle Day. That sounds so much fun. Of course she would want to interact with a special event like that. Buy a popcorn popper from being a foodie. Oh my gosh, Amelia. Okay, you know what? I'm going to do it. And let's also do a little bit of an upgrade because we've gotten several promotions lately uh, and we have seen how the adorable cafe looks. The Rosewater Cafe is truly the thing of inspirational dreams for how she wants to run her own place. So let's actually take a little bit of inspiration from that. We do have to pay some bills. I've got to remember that. So let's just transfer over 400 for now. And oh, look at the little love seats. Yes. Let's get a couch. <laughs> let's get at least one couch. Let's let's do this. Oh, look at the cat couch. We want to have some nice cat couch lounges that people can just enjoy hanging out here at the cafe and oh my gosh, what color should we go for? Just some nice white. There's some green ones. They're so cute. I want people to be really comfy and happy here. Purple. That green is kind of appealing and it has blue. And Sky is really into greens and blues. So we might make this kind of like a green and blue themed cafe. But this is like the very first decor piece that she's gotten for this whole place. <laughs> oh, I should have her study here. I'm gonna put it kind of over here and let her just kind of lounge and study some of the cookbooks that her grandma gave her. Gosh, this is one little piece at a time because we do have like some expensive bills to pay. So I do need to go ahead and pay those. Uh, one little piece at a time. Hopefully we'll take the cat cam tomorrow and we'll even dress up Clover and take Clover. <gasps> Tien! 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 Oh my gosh. Um, Tien, I gotta lecture you about this. Tien, give some food to Tien. Let, look face. No, Tien! Tien, no, no cat, f no human food. No human food. Why can I not ever pet care, Simstagram? Why can I never correct his behaviors? All right, oh, she's just so excited to see her cat. Uh, I need a popcorn popper, but we, I, we don't have any money for it now. Tien, no, how do I do the opposite of praise you? <laughs> oh, we can pamper the cats on the couch. Okay, let's go ahead and pamper on couch. Our beloved Clover, can we take off the, oh, we can remove the cone. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna pet him and then remove the cone. Tien. Ugh. Okay, we'll fill the love with Tien. Apparently we cannot correct the behavior that he has. Oh, Clover. Are you, are you comfy? Aww. There you go, Bobby. Um. We can cuddle Clover on the couch now. It's like our very own cat couch. This is what we want out of the future too. People being able to settle into the couches. Holy cow, these, like I never realized how tall these windows were before. <laughs> but this is what we want out of the future. People able just to settle in on the couch and cuddle with cats. This is the moment that we're finally feeling it. Tien, bad kitty cat. You were not supposed to go ahead and I, I, for some reason, I cannot correct, like, correct his behaviors, his negative misbehaviors whatsoever. Ah, oh well, we'll, we'll figure it out eventually. Can we fill the love at least? Because that would be really nice. Here, we're gonna stop doing this, and can we fill the love? Tien. I guess we can now. 
now that he's off the litter box. All right, well, at least that helps us a bit, get a little step closer to fulfilling all of these big aspirational goals. But all right, so this has been really fun. I was so tickled. We have no money again. Somehow that happened. Let's take off the cone. There we go. We can take off the cone from Clover at least. There you go, buddy. That should make you feel a lot better. Can I feel the love? I cannot feel the love. But all right, she's had a great day. She's feeling happy. She's cuddled the cats. She's done so much. She's got some great food that I'm gonna put into the fridge really quickly. Uh, and it's just been a great time for her. Hopefully, oh, let's put Poppy's autograph up. Oh gosh, that's gonna be exciting. What are you doing, Tian? So help me, are you scratching the furniture? No, he just likes hiding under tables. All right, well, he's he's an odd duck as it is. And we were gonna adopt him out on Wednesday, but it honestly feels like we just have not had enough time with him. Uh, I think we're gonna actually go ahead and we're gonna keep Tien until we manage to get the cafe up and going. Uh, so Clover has a friend and we're gonna keep him until we have some kittens around and then we'll find the perfect home for him. All right, there's Poppy's autograph. Can I Can I put it up on the wall? I could have sworn, can I, oh, is her little autograph just this tiny little thing? Oh, that's so cute. I, I was, I thought you could put all of the autographs on the wall, but this is just, oh, cause she's a smaller time celebrity. Oh, that's adorable. So we can't actually like, can we admire it? If I put it over here, maybe here, we'll put it on the counter, I guess. I guess since she's a small time celebrity, it's not something that can go <laughs> up on the wall. But can we come over and just That's admire cool. this little picture? That's so cute. All right, well, we're gonna keep that in our pocket as a little good luck charm. But all right, so tomorrow, Tomorrow in Amelia Sky Baker's Life, we have the castle tour. And I think we're going to break out the cat cam and we are gonna see what Clover and what Amelia can do unleashed upon a castle with a, a bunch of video to record, arguably for Amelia's grandmother, but hopefully it'll go viral and we can start off working on some of that fame. But above everything else, we are going to be working on filling as many of, and playing an instrument is useful because she does want to go work on a pipe organ in the morning. But we're gonna work on as many of these aspiration points as possible and try to climb our way up to those 4,000. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I am just absolutely falling in love with everything about the way that we are living life with our wonderful Amelia and with her beloved cats. We're definitely going to keep Tien for a while. He's just beginning to become a member of the family, but one that as a foster cat parent, we will be okay with seeing go to a new family one day. Uh, and I'm just, I'm just loving this. So thank you guys so much for all of your support. If you could do please leave a like and consider subscribing if you want to join us for this and literally thousands more adventures. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.